Hey guys, I'm Rachel and today I have a guest on my channel. This is her third appearance. Everybody say hi to my beautiful daughter, my mini me. Hello. Hi. So today we are doing a makeover. I am transforming my daughter into me. <laughs> so let's hop into it. So her skin is pretty young, so we're not gonna do anything crazy. Um, we don't have much prepping and priming to do, so I'm using Fenty Beauty Primer, and I'm using it on a brush. Whenever I do clients' uh, makeup, I always tend to use a brush. So I'm starting with her brows because that's just what I do on myself. My brows are done last, but, well not last, but I never do my brows first. But I like to do brows first whenever I'm working with anyone because um, it's just easier that way for me because the eyes take longer. And the brows are actually is not my favorite part to do on someone. So I'm just gonna add a little bit of this product in her brow. And we still want her to look fresh and young when we're done, so we're not going to be caking on the makeup too much. And there we have it. The brows are done. Just simple, nothing crazy. Just to give it a little definition. So I'm going to close your eyes for me, Phoebe. I'm going to do her, um, her shadows first, because like I said, I always tend to do the eyes first. And just use a little bit of the ColourPop concealer, just to cancel out eyelids and to get um, an even canvas I'm gonna apply just a little bit of setting powder to her upper crease area okay so I'm starting with perception palettes mm -hmm. I'm thinking about doing something that's bronzy because I wanted to have a red lip so we are going to start with the color uh, Culture. It's a soft brown on a Morphe M443 brush. Close your eyes and leave your eyes closed throughout the tutorial, okay? Mm -hmm. And I'm applying this in her crease. I don't know if you guys could see. Let me zoom it in a little bit more so they can see you more than me. All right, so I zoomed your guys in so you can see better. So we're just applying the transition in her crease, back and forth, the windshield wiper motions. We use the color played out on the same brush to deepen the crease a little bit more. But I'm applying it lower than the first color. making sure to blend it really well with the first transition shade so sorry about the angles okay so I'm gonna take this Almy um, foil cream shadow as a base because I want something that's more bronzy I'm just taking a little bit on this concealer brush and I'm gonna apply it on her lids And then bringing it right underneath that um, deeper brown, and sort of blend it into that. Turn so they can see, like so. This is coming along nicely. Phoebe is so quiet; she isn't saying a thing. I don't know why. So this is what we have so far. What are you calling this look after it? Mm, I don't know. It's just something like summery. Like we're gonna apply a bronzy color over top. Why you choose this brush? Because it's smaller 
and I can get more uh, precise and it packs the pigment on really nice with minimal fallout. Alright, so I'm just going to go back with the brush with very little product on it and mesh these two colors together. Mesh the two colors together. Close your eyes. Very simple but still has an uh, makes an impact. So we had actually no fallout or minimal fallout on her eyes. So I'm gonna go in with a foundation. I wanna use something light, but it's like skin then. Phoebe is like lighter than me. Yeah. But I still want I'm gonna use <coughs> my shade because mm. it's gonna give her just a little bit of a tan. Which is going to be perfect. It's going to complement this look really nice. So I'm going in with L'Oreal Fresh Wear. And I'm using very little. Because she has good skin. So we don't, we're not trying to mask her too much and cover up everything. That was so relaxing. <laughs> Feels so good. If you guys can notice there is a bruise on her nose so let me give you a story about this bruise on her nose i don't know if she knows or remembers yes, i do remember how old were you i was like around six no you weren't i was younger than that you were way younger than that maybe two Th three, three there about three. and so her dad uh they um, owned a supermarket and <clears throat> this little one she, and she still is that way. She's very frontish. <laughs> we, oh, she's no. always in. She like she she does what you didn't ask her to do. Like kids, like I don't know. I can't explain it. So they probably was looking for paper towel, I believe. I was looking for paper towel. And it was on a height. And instead of asking someone to <coughs> get her the paper towel, she insists on climbing to get the paper towel, <coughs> and fell and got stitches as you can see the whole skin lifted up and she had to be rushed to the hospital and got some mini stitches on her nose and now she has a mark to remember forever now i'm just doing a little highlight i'm using kkw concealer and like i said we are not doing too much oh yeah one of your friends asked me he was like you still have this mark on your nose. I was like, yeah. Yeah, she has this scar is for life. It's not going anywhere. But it fit me now. Oh, well, we got used to seeing you with it. <laughs> mm, that color fit her so good. <laughs> the KKW. Phoebe's face is very tiny. Her face is just like mine. I have a very small face. <laughs> the features in her face are very small. Use some of my Fenty Beauty and Blondie powder mixed together, the Huda Beauty Blondie that I showed you guys in my last tutorial. And I'm just gonna press that underneath. I'm not gonna be doing baking because her skin doesn't need it. Just pressing it everywhere I place the concealer so that it doesn't crease. Not like if it's gonna crease anyway. She has no lines, no wrinkles. What it feels like to be 16. <laughs> I wish I was 16 again. No bills, no stress, <laughs> no worries. Kids these days don't realize how easy they got it. No bills, nothing. Everything mommy and daddy has to do it. But they're always in such a rush to get big, to be grown. Mom, um, just stay a little girl, a little baby. It's not possible. <laughs> your kids grow so so fast like when i look at phoebe sometimes tears come to my eyes because it's like where did the time go and i feel like when she was a baby like i had phoebe pretty young so i wasn't in the best place in my life i'm going in with the fancy bronzer just to add some color back to her face i wasn't uh, at the best place in my life and i don't feel like i was 
the best parent and i used to beat myself up about it a lot but i've forgiven myself so if you're someone who who's in a situation like me forgive yourself because kids do not come with manuals and you learn as you go yeah you learn as you grow so i stop beat myself up about it and forgive myself like the older she gets the better mom i become and that's what it is because i'm learning i guess if i was to have another kid i probably would be better at it which is not which she's not going but, to have yes but. that's not gonna happen <laughs> You see her face come into life. You see it, <coughs> Phoebe? I, like, I see, I can see the, I can see Oh, it, it looks so good. Yay. So I'm going in with my blushing in Bali palette. And I want to use this soft pink and this sort of um, peachy color on her cheeks. And I'm using the same brush. Don't smile too much. To apply that just right over the bronze. Mommy, you really think picture look good? For example, I'm a junior now, and by senior year, do you think a peach dress is going to look cute on me? I don't know, Phoebe. Oh, do you see that? Ah, oh, Listen, this makeup look is so easy. So, so, so easy to achieve. It's not funny. Because she has, literally has nothing going on with her skin. It's just 19 minutes into this video. 19 and we're almost completed. So I'm just gonna add a little nose contour. Sorry for the positions, you know, if I'm blocking anything. We're just gonna give her a slimmer nose because she took her grandmother's nose. It's certainly not my nose and it's certainly not her dad's nose. Her dad's nose is straight as an arrow. Not that her nose isn't straight, but it's not our nose. She took everything from her grandmother. Alright, so we're going to complete the bottom lashes now. Oh, and I'm lashes. taking... I don't know. I'm taking the deeper brown. Watch up for me. And run that to her bottom lashes. like so um, you know some people eyes can be covered like whenever i'm doing someone's makeup the bottom lashes are always the most difficult to do because they tend to blink and they don't know how to stay looking up and things like that turn more towards me so i can see and i'm just buffing it off giving her a real smoky bottom lash highlight to her inner corners I'm using the same perception palette for everything. This one. I love this palette. It's one of my favorite palettes. I'm gonna do a current favorite video soon so you guys can see what I'm loving. I'm just gonna run the excess underneath her brows. We'll put more on the inner corner. All right. right perfect let me see perfect perfect all right so now i'm gonna set her face Yo, her face looks so good you guys see that i'm gonna use my mac uh fix plus in gold light close your eyes on me phoebe just apply some of this leave your eyes closed and let that dry all right, so now I'm going back to the same blushing in Bali palette and I'm using the highlight shades. <clears throat> Turn. And just to the highest point of her cheeks. And sort of wrap it around her temples. Like so. And put a little bit on the base of her chin. I just love putting highlights on your chin. Back on the other side. And I'm gonna take a smaller <clears throat> brush for her nose. Then her cupid's bow. Oh, 
this looks. Yeah, I'm shiny. Add a little bit of extra highlight. I'm shiny. All right, so now before we complete her eyes, I'm gonna do her lips because I'm gonna let her do her mascara on her own. But we're doing the lips, so <laughs> bend your lips in for me. Not too much. I want to see the lip line. Doing someone's lips and their brows are not my favorite part of applying makeup for anyone. I always, I don't know, you have to be so precise with it. And I feel like on my own, I have a difficult time with applying my lips already. <laughs> Did you press? Don't press. I am probably gonna have to clean that up with some concealer. Neaten that up with some with my um lip brush and and then I'm gonna um clean the edges off a little bit because of course I got sloppy with it. This is not my lips. They are not my lips. Let me put a lipstick. Which lipstick I use? This one that you're holding in your hand. This one? Yes. Okay, and 20 hours later, I tried to get the lips um, to look good. So I'm gonna let her apply her mascara and we'll be right back. And there we have it, she did her lashes. Phoebe has, a, I wish, I don't know if you guys could see the length of her lashes. Her lashes are like so freaking long, so long. Beautiful, all right, come back. So we have to add a wig. To this look okay this look won't be listen your edges might not be showing okay right. <laughs> let me see me put it on that's what i said the look won't be completed without a wig of course everyone knows me for wigs i'm the wig girl i love wigs i'm not a sewing girl wigs all the way i love to take my hair off when i get home whoa 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 And there we have <laughs> Phoebe, her makeover. I dare do look like you. <laughs> Let, let's see. Like, <laughs> so there we have it, um, the makeover. <laughs> What do you guys think? Comment down below. Oh my God. I'm so happy that I have a daughter. When I was pregnant, I always wanted a daughter, but I never wished for it. I was like, whatever <laughs> came, came. I was so happy I got a daughter. And now that she's getting older, I can do more stuff with her and she's more understanding and I can be totally honest with things I say to her and things like that. So. I love the teenage the teenager phase because knock on wood I have a good kid. She is a very good. She listens and things like that. So I'm I'm very grateful and thank God for that. So thank you guys so much for watching. And hi, if you're new here, my name is Rachel and Phoebe. <laughs> um, everything. Well, I may list the products in the description box. It wasn't mostly about the products. It was just mostly about uh, you know transforming her, but. All my social media links and my platform um, all my social media links would be in the description box on how to book me i am a nail tech and a makeup a makeup artist out here in brooklyn so you can check the description box for that follow me on my social media platforms see my work so until then let's continue to touch the world one face at a time and i'll see you in my next tutorial on sunday bye Come peace listen. guys comment below what you rate me out of 10? <laughs>
I think the wig is way too much, but <laughs> you get the drift. Anyway, thank you guys. Bye. Bye.